today I'm inside new Renault Austral and I just think about uh, reviewing the multimedia system and also I want to show you the new digital cockpit first of all I want to tell you that this is the same as you find in the new Renault Megane is the same system uh, the only difference that uh, is that Renault Megane it's an electric vehicle and this Austral will come also in a plug-in hybrid version and also with uh, IC uh, petrol engine uh, and diesel if I'm not wrong anyway uh, first of all the steering wheel has the same size very nice very modern and it has a new design added to it and also the quality it's very very good also we still have this multi-sense button here where you can change different driving modes and you can see there you have personal you have comfort mode you have echo mode you have sport mode uh, and you have a few driving modes there down here you have some physical button for the climatic system you can turn it off and on and I like the fact that they still keep those physical button this is really important um, to have it here when you drive it doesn't take your eyes off the road you just uh, learn it very fast and it's easy to use other than that I like also this kind of an island here that you can move it around forward and backward wireless charging right here to USB port 1 12 volt port there awesome I mean the way they integrate it here the screen it's great also the uh, multimedia screen it's huge and it's tilted to the driver so you have a very good visibility from the driver point of view this is also awesome now guys here we have some kind of glossy uh, buttons uh, on the steering wheel and from here you can change different views there on the screen so in the front you can have different views uh, it's a great screen great resolution great colors uh, and the most important thing and one of my favorite part is that the car use Google Maps so you have the Google Map in the middle it's awesome I mean you have all the updates uh, to the Google Map that the car will make and this is incredible good sorry about the noise guys but it's uh, I'm in Paris at auto show and it's so there are so many people today so i cannot do it so right i will do again another review as soon as i can but yeah just keep in mind another thing that i want to point out is that this is a glossy screen and it's crazy responsive man i mean it's it's much more responsive than much more premium cars that have double the price look how responsive it is you have the google map and it works really really fast and this is great if you want to put for example the navigation here and just wait a little bit and you can see how simple and how fast it's routing and it's it's calculating the route there and it's fabulous I have to tell you I like it and also you can see the traffic it shows you also the traffic where is traffic the same as on the Google map and also it shows you where the roads are close or whatever you can see right here in this area so this is a great multimedia system I like that I think it is I think Renault with this change they make a big step forward and they kind of kill the competition and I'm talking about many big car companies um, and I don't want to give name but this is a really good multimedia media system also uh, it's very responsive as you can see it's go through the menu very simple it's very simple to use uh, here for example you can change different driving modes comfort echo sport and personalize also you can configure it from there if you go to electric here you can see the energy flow while you're driving it shows you a nice energy flow there the camera 360 degrees camera the car come with 360 degrees camera you cannot see it right now because the doors are kind of open right now and but it, it's, it's it's a great system to have uh, in your car we have then the seats right here the passenger seats and your seats you can kind of uh, control it also it has massage on your seats so you can activate and deactivate it from here very good system in the same price uh, if you have to get it in a Mercedes or BMW you will probably have to pay double the price uh, the quality of the air you have also the purifier air purifier here that you can activate and deactivate great system again driving echo it gives you some scores and some information about the car by the way let me stop the climatic system it's very simple to stop it uh, and also to control the temperature from down here and I like that very much it's also a conference here around me so sorry about the noise guys uh, let's go forward here are all the safety features you can activate deactivate like lane assist adaptive cruise control emergency brake all that safety feature are here and what what impressed me the most is how responsive this system it is and how good it's well array here in the in the media I like very much what they did with it and I think it's 
it's it's lovely and so easy to to learn uh, and so easy to to manage them and uh, they really did a great job from what I heard uh, from the uh, engineer behind it I heard that uh, they will bring even more apps in the future they have already here collaboration with Amazon Music, Easy Park, Liquip for uh, Renault and also uh, another application and in the future we will see even more so this is a really really good thing and I think uh, they are on the right track uh, also you can connect Android Auto and Apple CarPlay and yeah overall it's kind of the same multimedia system as on the Megane the only thing is that it's a little bit bigger also we have a bigger cockpit and a bigger screen here but really good great job anyway that was the video I hope you enjoyed don't forget to like share subscribe and I see you next time bye guys